Joe Paterno's family has released a report blasting Louis Free's investigation into the Penn State sex abuse scandal. Joe's wife Sue is speaking out. Sue Paterno has remained quiet since the scandal first rocked Penn State a year and a half ago until now. She talked with Katie Couric right here on WNEP TV this afternoon. Joe Paterno's wife Sue has not spoken since the scandal broke and her husband died. Sue Paterno, thank you for being here. With tears in her eyes, Sue Paterno went on national television to defend her husband, with Katie Couric asking questions so many have wanted the Paterno family to answer. He admitted, though, before he died, that he wished he had done more. Well, you're missing the whole sentence. Is with the benefit of hindsight, I wish I had done more. Hindsight came because of what we learned later. In 2001, it isn't a question of heat. If he knew what he knew, if he knew in 2001 what he then learned in 2011, yes, he would do more. Anyone would. Sue Paterno talks of the night Joe was fired over the phone and the anguish that followed as the Paterno struggled with the firing, Joe's illness, death, and the accusations against Jerry Sandusky. Do I wish it hadn't happened? Absolutely. I mean, I'm horrified. Um, I've had so many sleepless nights. And I end up praying for all the victims because I want them to heal and move on with their lives. Sue Paterno says she actually looked forward to Lewis Free's report into the Penn State handling of the Sandusky scandal until she heard Free blame her husband with a cover-up. For someone who knew somebody for 54 years, I knew him better, and he was what he was. What you saw is what you got. A man of integrity, honesty, he never let down in any of his moral values. His life was built on doing things the right way. And for Louis Free to say what he did about Joe, I was in a state of disbelief. The family appeared on Katie the day after their lawyers issued a report blasting the Free investigation as incomplete and biased. How much of this is about restoring your father's good name? I would say very little. Yeah. Very little. He, um, that was not a concern of his. His concern was always what, what, would, what would the right thing be to do, and this is the right thing. While there have been many Paterno critics, there have also been plenty of supporters, and for that, Sue Paterno offered a thank you. The last year has been quite a challenge, and I thank God for God, my faith, our family, our friends, and all the, all the innumerable people who have written letters about what Joe meant to them and what encounters they had with him, and that has helped. You can read the results of the Paterno family investigation into the free report under websites mentioned at WNEP.com.